This team is fun to watch because they share the ball. It is not just one player. They are the sum of the parts. And that's what I think can make you really dangerous in college basketball. It's, it's Sherrod's team. She knows it. it. She's got the keys. Jump in, everybody. Jump in. I've got you. We're going to go like hell. She's a warrior. She's tenacious. And she's also such a good defender. So if, if she's the head of your snake, you're going to be good. And that's what Jalen Sherrod brings. Charlotte Whitaker is one of the glue pieces of your program. And if you talk about the rise of Colorado basketball, you have got to include Charlotte Whitaker. She's been there through the tough times, and now she's rocking and rolling in the good times. And Frida absolutely lets it fly. She did so in the NCAA tournament, in the Duke pod. She did so against LSU. And the bus now know that in big games, when you need a shot, a steal, a rebound, Frida Foreman can get it for you. And then I think Quay Miller and Aaronette Von Ley complement each other really well. Miller is comfortable around the free throw line. She's comfortable hitting that 15 foot jumper and she can pass it. And then Von Ley is so strong inside and has great touch. Aaronette's confidence just built from the start of the season to the end of the season to where now this year, she knows she's a dominant player and she goes out there and proves it night in and night out. Two transfers coming in, and Sarah Rose Smith and Maddie Mullen, who really could have gone anywhere, and she chose the bus because she watched them in the tournament last year and watched a team um, that she felt you know, had something special going on. But it's Kendall Weta. I mean, you know, if you want to describe CU women's basketball, you just watch Kendall Weta on the court. She's so tough and great. You talk about being defensive-minded in many ways. She feels like the captain of the defense in that way and the way that she represents this state. Kendall is basically a sixth starter for this team, and really coming off the bench, she provides that spark, not only defensively, but more so now offensively. The team, I think, has an incredible quiet confidence, and you see that in their play, and you see that in their work ethic, and you see that every week where they are somehow getting better and better, right, and developing different parts of their game.